My aesthetic kind of matches my brain, which is all over the place. I like to play with different shapes and colors and whatever I'm kind of feeling in the mood to make. I'm Laura Stewart and I'm a mixed media artist. We're gonna be redesigning my craft room. I spent some time designing the rest of the house and kind of ignored this area, so I'm really looking forward to getting it up to speed with the rest of the house. I took the color ID quiz from Sherwin-Williams and my palette is Dreamer. The palette was super cohesive and it was very easy to choose colors that went well together and it had a good assortment of neutrals and pops of brighter colors. The Dreamer palette is artistic and warm and I just feel like it's me. The first thing that I designed in the room was the wall mural and I wanted to bring in my love for shape and color. The final shape that I wanted to add to the wall mural was a circle and I used the coral clay and it popped off that wall perfectly. I moved on to the built-in cabinets. The first color that I applied in the built-ins was the Anchors Away. I used it as an accent in the back of each shelf. The deep blue gave the shelves depth and made the light pop through the window. I chose the tamarind color to add some warmth I pulled in the tamarind color in the cabinets as well as the storage unit. I wanted to spice it up and do a little line drawing and keep it just fun. I'm obsessed with the final cabinet. I feel like it just looks like a totally different piece and it's one of my favorite things in the room. I brought in the Gray's Harbor to create just a bold entrance. I brought in a few books and plants to just give it some life. I'm so excited about the finished room. I feel like it totally transformed the entire house. The color palette brings the whole room to life. It adds so much energy and warmth. The room fits me so much better now, and I can't wait to use it and get creative and come up with a million more ideas.